we are um playing Madden again. That is 17, sadly. But uh, Christmas is on its way, and we're going to get 20. I pray I get 20. I hope I get 20. And when I get 20, it's going to be crazy. <laughs> it's going to be crazy, you know what I'm saying? But today, the video is about custom characters. And we just made a whole custom character named Kenny Galladay. Not a real custom character because he's a real person. Plays with Detroit Lions, wide receiver. And, um... We made him in 2000, in 2017, right here. I mean, yeah, oh my god, 2020 coming up, new year, new me, psych, I'm gonna be the same me, Pfft, the heck, I ain't gonna be able to say that. But we gonna tell you about that later on in the video. If I don't do it, remind me, please. We're gonna get started right now, enough talk, let's get it started. First level defensive line, second level linebackers, third we're actually level watching them play because we see Denver can score because we are actually two sports on the board. So see if Denver can score. Because like they played yesterday and we lost. The Lions going with an extra DB here on third down. Yeah, um, we're cursed. Top of him. And just toss it away. So he throws it away and that brings up fourth down. Here's Riley Dixon now. Well done, baby. He's on to punt for Denver. I don't see Kenny Galladay play. And for that, I'm going to go back on defense. And he's getting a workout here in this first quarter as he gets it away. And this is going to hit the goal line and continue on into the end zone for a touchback. And Detroit getting set to go now. It's got the lead. Last time had to punt it, though. What's the key to this drive? I think it's leverage. Ah, the leverage. big guys there up front. Right number you know the motivation He's really number 19, but I had to make 18. Guys, 19 was taken. Protect the passer. So create easy. space for our runners. And let's go ahead and get these guys. Low man wins. Let's go do it on this drive. <laughs> we'll watch that leverage on this drive. And on the outside, they're playing press coverage. Going, take... They start the drive with Abdullah. Okay, Abdullah. Wow. Abdullah. Wow. Ten, five, touchdown, Detroit. Amir Abdullah, an 80-yard touchdown. And the Lions add on to their lead. Damn. And with that carry, he's Eat already over dust. 100 yards here in the first half. And I Parker said dust. That's exactly what he's saying to his teammates right now, right? Especially to the Eat play caller. Give me the ball. Again, <laughs> and, again, and again, again, and again. It's not that heavy, sir. I'll take it. Hey, he pulled up again today. <laughs> game today. He pulled up again today. To oh, that's crazy. He done made a t twenty. He made a hundred yard touchdown. If you kick this field goal, he got twenty one points on the board. He's number twenty one. Twenty one just for a touchdown. He made twenty points on the board. You get it. You get it. You get. Those are the ones the offensive coordinators dream about. One play drive. Let's get it. Alrighty, let me get back in this game. Back in that game. Okay. Um. Let's get it. 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 That distance won an effort. It results in the touchdown. Our defense is going. Oh, Bila. Splash me. I'm going to put it in here. Now I'm going to get it. That's fielded in the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. And Denver getting set to take the field. And down on the scoreboard, certainly needing to avoid what happened on the last drive, punting the football. Sense of urgency has to take over for them here. They know the score. They know the situation. And by the way, the punter no longer exists for their offense. That's how they have to treat this drive. They need points. Big time. Start the drive with Anderson. 
He's trying, he's trying to do what I tried to do. You know what I did. No, I, I'm not even going to touch him. I'm not even going to touch him. I'm not even going to Finally finds a way to break through and get a really nice gain. The defense had felt great about what they had going. Now they've got to turn their attention to getting it back in that direction. Can they bottle him up again? Because I'd say after that run, confidence is pretty high for him. And he'll toss this one in. Hey, Junior. No options. He throws it away. Okay, it's like... And on second and ten now. Second and ten, Simeon again. Oh, I could it incomplete, and their struggles continue here. One of the best routes, one of the favorite routes of any play caller. Yeah, yeah, no. He just ran that one. Nice little angle route. That's supposed to be a catch, and usually it is in running back drop. Yeah, I mean, he's a running back, but he's got hands. He should have caught it. And he got your man. The gun on third, Simeon. Damn, the boy got trapped. He had nowhere to throw, so he just tossed it away. But that brings up fourth. But no second guessing the call. Man, I feel like uh, long, they so put a curse on Detroit Lions. Probably the smart play to try and pick it up. But they don't get it, and now the defense goes off the field feeling pretty good about themselves gaining some momentum as they force them into a likely punting situation. Here's Riley Dixon now. He's been one of their few bright spots so far. I am on my Christmas break. Oh, I'm like to block that one. He's going to go ahead and field it from the three-yard line. A big kick there. We'll call it 56 yards on the punt. And the Lions are going to take over with a long field ahead and a first and ten. The Broncos defense getting <laughs> oh ready. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's just so insane. Bad to see. Play. They've got to go out there now yeah. and put an end to what's been going on in this ball okay, game. Okay, we're going to do points, Got pushed hmm. around, so to speak, during this contest. They've got to find a way to end it right here, right now. Can they end it? Let's find out. Here's Stafford. Survey the field. He's going to walk Shoot. one deep on, inside on. here. Oh! He's caught inside the 35. A big play there for Detroit. 59 yards. Well, we know he's got the speed there. He needed the speed and the hands. A great catch. And because of that speed, you have to respect it as a defender. Look at that so one you hand. have to either play off or make sure you're somehow in contact with him. And he's able to do exactly what you said. Use the speed to his advantage and go up and get the football. That's a big time play right there. So the Jesus. offense has it first and ten. Jesus. No, I'm at the Jones. I'm not getting going on the Jones. Come on, you got it. To the sideline, and oh, a nice catch there. Made sure the feet were inbounds, and they were. That's Jones. Let's make this one simple. What a catch, especially the finishing part of getting his feet inbounds, toe tapping, and of course, foot dragging. A little tapestry, if you want. Come on, Jones. Oh, I like it. Stampers. No, he almost had it. Already with one interception, just missing his second there. Yeah, I did get exactly a banner start to this game. We're still in the first quarter. It's already thrown into the second. Uh, and that should have been the second one. And the Broncos go to a nickel set on third down. Yeah, they've got an extra DB out there. To throw his and the pressure gets to him and brings him down. Stafford is sacked. Brandon Marshall in there to drop him for a six-yard loss, and that'll lead to a fourth down. Well, this has been a pretty sizable drive. They've had some success. Finally, the defensive coordinator found some success of his own. I think he just simply said enough of that. Okay, they've moved the ball well. We need to force the issue from our end, and that's exactly what he did. Come on, 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 come on. Come on. No! The Lions turned away on fourth down. And the Broncos will take over on downs. The Broncos offense now gets ready to head back onto the field. And with this deficit, you can't have too many more drives like the last drive where you had to punt it away. You know what I would tell my offense right here? 
The punter doesn't exist, guys. He doesn't even exist. <laughs> He's not a team anymore. I just cut it. All right? So you want to And now the Lions going to stop us momentarily as they call I mean the to out. out. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. That was a touchdown. Dang. All right. And now I'm going to every day. Out the defense back out onto the field. There was no zone coverage that was supposed to be even, so. Two yards in. He don't run it, that's why. He don't run it. I don't know. Boy. He ain't going anywhere, boy. Ezekiel Ansah in there to bring him down. 12, y'all, boy. Oh, so boy. Oh, boy. Now, let's see what the offense has in store for third. Off the fake to Booker and Simeon. Again. Again. Give me again. Hit me again. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. At the end of one. 21 to nothing our score Charles and I back to Denver after this beautiful one hand catch look at that one hand catch back alongside Charles Davis I'm Brandon Gordon. it's Bronco football to begin quarter number two but likely not for long as they're in punt formation to kick it away here's Riley Dixon now. As boy, 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 Jamal Jones, Bobby Long, Shea Jones. There you go, boy. That was a nicely run slant route, and what the receiver's trying to do is make the defender think he's going upfield for a deeper route, and then breaks it off. I'll call the best Three to four steps, and cuts towards the middle of the field, and now what he's trying to do is use his body to keep the defender away from the football and get the quarterback a really nice target. I should die. only a yard there, and they'll be left with a third and very short. Well, praise has to go to the guys in the offensive line because they've had a very nice productive day running the football. How about that poor defensive line? They've been knocked around the entire game, and while they slowed him down on that run, can they continue to do so? There you go. Because they haven't had much success throughout this ball game. And he has the first down yardage before they bring him down right at the 45. And he continues to pile up the yardage. That puts him over a buck fifty now. And this defense has really had its problems trying to keep him contained. All right, Coach Jackson, what do you got, Coach? So the run moves the chains, and here we go on first down. Stafford on first down. And he's got his man in stride Tate. complete. Give him nine there on the first down completion. And Tate just finished his seventh NFL season. First four in Seattle, last three Detroit. And each of those three years, 90 or more receptions. Oh, he played for Seattle. I forgot. Catches over 1,000 yards. Now he went to the Eagles. Uh, I saw him operate out wide in the slot. Also came into the backfield and got carries and then ran routes from there. His yards after catch really jumped back up in 2016. And Golden Tate has shown that he's more than capable of being a number one receiver in the NFL. So not only is that his third touchdown catch of the game, he's done it here in the first half. I'm not sure defensively what they're going to come up with to slow him down because already we're seeing him run past over through guys in order to make these catches and being able to try and shut him down at this stage of the game it's going to take a lot of effort so maybe it'll open things up for some other people well, one thing i like is jones and kenny galladay the most best wide receiver couple of no homo but like I, I mean in a good way but like in a good way i'm trying to say the in a good way right that time five like, plays like, and it's capped off change. by a touchdown for the lions 
No, you don't want to say that. No, say that. Uh, not that. Not that little nasty stuff. No, not that. I'm like saying that that's a good wide receiver couple. So the touchdown, like, Martin now they, to they, have a good, they can both catch. They're good. Play for the Lions. They're cold. They call this world. Is a couple yards deep. They'll bring it back to just about the 25. Call it the 24 yard line. Oh, yo, guys, I got an idea. I got an idea. Should have played this game because literally 15 right minutes in the corner. Someone's gonna take charge in the you know, you know what? This is what I'm about to do. To I'm about to make a second video in one day. Two, two star, days special. Well, so Someone what I'm about to do, I'm lucky about to post this video after this video and This video is going to be an hour. I know. I got. I know it's going to be an hour. Like, First down, here's the run with Anderson. And there just continues to be no one to go. Yes, I have an idea. So, my idea is. You talk about those defensive tackles, those nose tackles. They're not just big, they're immense. And what a big time play there. Oh! Oh, oh yes, yeah, Slay! As if the first one that he threw, he couldn't shake, couldn't get it out of his head. He ends up throwing a second one as a result. Oh. Yeah, you got to be able to forget, compartmentalize, whatever you want to call it, and move on. He hasn't been able to do so here in the second. Here comes Matthew Stafford now to lead his offense back out there. Hey. He's been in a pretty good group. They actually have more yards on the ground than through the air, but both have been good, pretty balanced. And have we ever met a coach when we've talked to him before a game hey. that hasn't mentioned wanting to be balanced? No. Because then you, you've got both sides hitting the defense. They don't know what to expect. Right? Yeah. Hey. It helps the play calling. Because now you're in a position where you're confident in either one, oh. either aspect of the game. Oh, okay, okay. Dial it up and let it go. And so far, that's allowed them to lead. Absolutely. Have the lead here in the second quarter. And boy, they had high praise for this rookie receiver when we asked the coaches about him, didn't they? The thing they don't they don't know their receiver name. That's the problem. Brought him on to the team. Height, weight, speed, all of that. But like, they just call him like a rookie receiver. That's what they really liked about him. The way he goes after the football, competes for it, and decides when it's in the air, it's his and only his. It goes as a gain of eight and it moves the chains. Bro, I missed that. You know you got a drag route on as your primary call. You got to be yeah, he broke his ankle. <laughs> oh, look at, oh, look at. <laughs> Bro, my dog's ankle is <laughs> lost. Alright. Now a first down throw, Stafford. One hand. Detroit, their big body receiver, on his way to a historic performance with four first half touchdowns. One hand caught again. Continue to pour it on, and let's count them up now. One, two, three, four touchdown receptions for him in this game. And just one shot, the NFL record. Kenny Galladay, dog. You playing like that in real life. And, the end zone. and he look, look at him. He look humble, too. Crater on at the extra point. And he's been a busy man. Five for five. Five for five. Traders to five. Now he got to miss the rest of the field goal. Scoring <laughs> Okay. And the end result, a Detroit touchdown. My big go what with me. Uh, uh, go big big what you get. Uh, Here's Martin now big, big, following the score as he'll send this one away. And no, on that baby. And no run back here. He was like, everything better on baby time. Oh Lord, this is the made of now it's gold. And following the interception, just any interception, are you a little bit more cautious when you start that next drive or no? You just throw that out the window. 
I think you are. I don't think that there's any way you can run back out there and go, ah, totally didn't affect me. Let's just go ahead and be loose with the football. <laughs> You're going to take care of it, but you have to be careful about being too cautious because now you can't run any offense at all. Still want to attack. We'll see how they attack him here. Call it a gain of four on first, and that'll make it second down. Not a run that you're going to write home about, but still a good first down run. That's what an offense calls staying on schedule. Three to four yards on first down. EDP 445, bro. He is so dumb, bro. Look, uh, subscribe to him. He's like, he does some, like, <laughs> dumb stuff. But, like, this dude is funny. <laughs> like, he got some of the most stupidest topic ever. He hits Demarius Thomas. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across. I'm not going to answer to that. Look at that. Look how close that was. So here we go, first and ten now. In the backfield is Anderson, and they'll give it to him here. And he's going to take this one up only to about the 44-yard line. Three yards on the pickup there, and it'll be second down. Tough day. I'm the silk, and right I'm the milk. It's been that way the entire game. Not a whole lot of room to ramble for him. I tell you right, it's been that way all afternoon. Didn't get a whole lot better there. And he'll take this one up close to about the 45. Call it a gain of a couple, and that's going to leave him with a third and about five. I do know from experience that when you slow down someone's running... Imagine game, Barry Sanders being... Oh, my God. I got a freaking idea. But you still have to be alert for the draws and other plays of that nature. Bernie Sanders. He's got time in the pocket. I got an idea. Bernie Sanders on Detroit Lions in this year. Period. Cole, dog. Period. Cole. Cole. I got a big old idea. Cole. 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 This is away and a very good kick angled for the sidelines. It's a touch back. This will depend on the spot as it sails out of bounds. And they'll say it sailed out at the 10 yard line. Now Wait. The Lions offense, they get ready to head back. Always oh, sailed out. And they will simply, Charles, be looking to duplicate what they did last drive when they were able to push it in for six. And they hope it'll be that easy, right? To be able to take exactly what happened before, replicate it. They may have to make a few additional changes along the way because I'm sure the defense will make some adjustments. But they've got to have great confidence having scored the last time out. Well, tussle for what the this is going to be caught. 18 yards on the pick up there. And it'll be first down to Troy. And with that completion, he's now north of 200 yards here in the first half. Boy, a tough start for the secondary defensively. It is, and it's got to put a dent in their confidence. And, you know, you always want to keep that up and feel like you can always bounce back after. And that's caught inside the 35. Touchdown, Detroit! <laughs> a big play there! Seven yards! And the Lions have got it on cruise control. And that touchdown reception is the fifth for him in this game, and that ties the NFL record. And a record that's held up since 1950. This is another person that's tied it, but think about this. Bob Shaw said it in 1950. Kellen Winslow came along and tied it. And then, of course, Jerry Rice tied it as well. And finally, we're seeing it here one more time. Phenomenal. Now, Plater to add the PAT. I'm on a cruise. Shit, I might end this a little early. Because, like, you know, I might about to win. Bro, this is a good idea. I might add in. I might, yeah, I might end it early. At the bad, I'm asking you. A very short and sweet drive that got him in the end zone. Let's try it out. So after the touchdown, Martin oh, now Morphin, I'm going to get this one away. Oh, Morphin, I'm going to get it. This is taking about seven. <laughs> no run back here. This will be a touchback. And it comes out to the 25-yard line. 
Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Come on, D. 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 Come on, D
I'm at custom make it and by environment on match make a whole hoodie and say CJ game time dog pick that little Iron Man little and Denver getting set to take the field. And on the last go around, they really couldn't get anything going. They had to punt from deep inside their own territory, which means they're going to lose the field position battle as a general rule. What they're looking for now is a little more consistency. Move the ball at least a few times on offense, get a couple of first downs, and hopefully flip the field. Yeah, just something to build off of. That's what they're looking for here. Baby, not call me baby. Oh my thing Okay, let's go. No everybody on that baby, huh? Who's usually gonna win now? The tight end, but not there. Not in this situation. How about the corner defeating that logic and making a really nice tackle? To throw with Simeon. Rain down on me. Shoot up a bow, man. Shoot a loop of bow, man. Rain down on me. I got all these on me. So what I like is I like I know about no Earth Gang. Y'all know nothing about no Earth Gang, Dreamville, you know what I'm saying? Nigga, keep you a little bit deep. Oh, deep. Oh, deep. Oh, deep. Oh, deep. Oh, Return it's Dang. A good return there. Call it 13 yards. And the offense will come back onto the field for the first and 10. And Detroit getting set to go now. And following that long touchdown pass, a one play drive last time. Let's see if the defense, you know they're ready. They don't want that to happen again. And you would have thought they would have been ready the last time. I mean, that's what you work on all the time. Make sure that no one gets behind you. That's the cardinal sin. There is a whole bunch of stuff going on. Okay. In that, in that, in that, in that picture, though. Let's give a lot of credit to the offensive line. They've been able to move the ball really take. well on the ground the entire game. And while that wasn't a huge one, that's okay. They'll take them in short, steady bursts. Over the middle, complete to Tate. Like Six yards is the big up, and that'll uh, lead to a third down. Never make the mistake that the slot receivers, especially the little guys like we're watching here, yeah, they're are just quicker than fast. A lot of them combine quickness and speed, yeah, yeah, yeah. and they catch a lot of footballs, as we just saw there. Rain down on me. They come up in an offset eye. They'll run here. Abdullah. Oh. oh. He's at the 40. Pass the 20. <laughs> touchdown, Detroit. Amir Abdullah with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Lions have got it on cruise control. Let's go, baby. Oh, He'll just sit there at the half and think, all right, two already. I can get some more. I can get some more. And he'll be encouraging his offensive line to create some space. And the route Rain out on me. Doug. I feel like I would literally go lose subscribers if I keep on doing that bull crap. Alright. Alright. World champion. They did win the Trying championship. But Oba retired, so. This is fielded a couple yards deep. And he'll wind up about four yards shy of where he would have been if he had taken a knee as they'll start at the 21 yard line. Merry Christmas, everybody. It's gonna be it's gonna it's not gonna be a white Christmas. Sadly. I in my in my country, in my in my in my Uraba country. There's no there's no there's no there's no there's no there's no, there's no, there's no, there's no snow in this hut. Okay. Alright, let's go. Ha <laughs> ha! You all got large. <laughs> Dog, I got bars. I don't care. We'll see. Oh, look at Thomas wide open. 
A good gain of 14 there and it moves the chain. Wide receiver wide open. Tie with keeper pie open. Long care red bottoms. Spring your autumn. What? Another tone here for the workhorse this afternoon. It's Anderson. No gain on the play. It'll be second down. Looked like he was trying to bounce it outside, but no success. Period, 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 period. Okay. Ah, oh, this hurt my throat in my heart. The defensive pursuit was there and just ran down. My girlfriend up there, my girlfriend's nice. She got ice. CJ Anderson, the intended target. Oh, that's me. Third down here for the. No, not zone. I meant to be man. I can't call a timeout. Oh, you're about to be. Throwing on third down. Second and ten. Let's go. We got that. We got that. We got that third and ten. Half time, I'm about to uh leave. And we're going to do something else. We're going to end this video like after halftime. Halftime report, we're going to end it. And that one hits at the seven, but bounds into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. And Detroit Stupid dog, why are you doing down. all this? Because it's a touchback. To the touchback. Touch touch and confidence is powerful, isn't it? When you score the runs, you feel like you can go back out there and get it done again. But no matter what the defense throws at them, they feel like they're in a groove right Rain now. Rain down on me. Yeah, hoping to stay in that groove here this goal. Sure, right? for fun, that's man. That's exactly what you want on a first down run. Pick up five yards, bring up second and five. The defensive line, though, they've got to figure out a way to out leverage the guys up front because the offensive line is winning at the point of attack. And for one of the few times here today, this one's not going to go anywhere. A couple of Broncos there in on the tackling. Let's see what they go to here on third down at six. So nothing there, but maybe blame that on the blocking. Yeah, at some point, you've got to win at the point of attack. And on that play, that was all the defense. They made it happen. He's going to launch this thing way downfield. He was trying to find Mark. What? Now fourth down. No. 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 Incomplete pass. An incomplete pass. <laughs> That's good. Boy, a curious decision to go for it doesn't pan out, and the Broncos are going to get the football back in great field position. And Denver getting set to take the field, position. and they'll be looking to avoid what happened last time, which is punting the football. But when you look at how teams play, the complimentary football. Comes into play. How do I take care of my defense? How do I take care of my offense? Get a flag. The defense is taking care of them in a lot of ways. Now it's time for the offense to jump things up and help their defense out. Give them a little bit of rest. Yeah, it's time to give them a rest. Took the words right out of my mouth. Simeon now to throw. Looking for his running back, and he's got it. It'll be a three yard game, and just like that, it's third down. Everyone's got to be able to catch the football. Doesn't matter what position you play, but if you're on offense, be aware, ball may come your way. So third and seven and an extra defensive back on the field here. Definitely want to play coverage here. He's going to let it go deep for the end zone. And I think uh, I think Casper so plays football now. He tried through the Casper, but it didn't work. Tremendous out. field position there, and a perfect time to do exactly what they did. Take a shot at the end zone. And they went for the big play, just unable to complete it. Man. And McManus able to put it through, and they'll get back three, but this remains a large deficit. Well, their offense has struggled for sure, but they get the field goal here to at least get on the board before half. And that's not something we should underestimate, because okay. just getting points on the board can sometimes have a settling effect on a team. Helps them start their comeback. Fielding about a yard deep. 
and he'll get it up to about the, the 25. And Detroit getting set to go now. And on that last drive, went for it on fourth, turned it over. A good job by their defense, though. They held them to three, but this offense, they've got to be a little bit better, a little bit more careful here. You're right, and sometimes you're right. when you see these calls on fourth down when they decide to go for it, it's not necessarily the coach saying, I believe in my offense. Oh, oh that was a good run. run. My defense. I can afford that was a beautiful here. run. Because if we don't get it, I don't think we'll give up more than three. And that's exactly what happened there. Oh, oh. I, I think that he had that in his mind going into the game, that I'm going to be aggressive on offense because I know I've got a defense that can hold up their end. Looks like the defense in press coverage here. Press cover my man Galladay. Down there, down down there already right. Now the defense loses him. It's complete. Touchdown, Detroit. Their big bodied receiver. 62 yards. And the Lions just continue to pour it on. I don't even know what to say anymore. I mean, I've lost track of how many times he's been in the end zone. This is just flat unbelievable. Doesn't matter whether you have an abacus, a calculator, just old fashioned pencil and paper trying to total it up. The number is staggering. What a performance. This man knows how to find the end zone and make it count. And the route is on here in this first half. Cause now this whole this thing is gonna be an hour. I'm trying to end it before I hit that. And they find the end zone for six points. The whole video better be an hour. So good, they're about to end it in like a couple more minutes. So uh half time comes out after the halftime report, time's up, we're done. Here's Martin now following the scores. Martin Lee, let's go, let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Don't keep on running it. We're gonna do zone. But they keep on running, they're not running. I'm gonna piss them off. We're gonna do a zone. So we're gonna, we're gonna keep on doing zone. And after that, we're gonna give it to Combs. And after that, we're gonna give it to Holmes. And that, I'm gonna eat Holmes Combs. And that, I'm gonna steal your man. I'm talking about that scam. I want to do that, man. PA piece. PA piece. PA piece. Where's the man coming? Found it. Think I found it. Think your mom is going to be back your daddy. Let's look ahead for a quick minute. We don't have the schedules yet for next year, but what we do have are the five international games that will be played. Four in London and then one again in Mexico. Jacksonville, Baltimore, Miami, New Orleans, Cleveland, Minnesota, Rams in Arizona. Those in London, and then Mexico's going to get a great game. The Raiders and New England. Yeah, you're exactly right. And just think about It's going to be a robbery because it's going to steal the ball and steal it like a robbery. And we'll go to head and look on name of poverty. Mexico. Yeah, watch it the Raiders are coming to town. That should be a whole lot of fun. Should be a ton of fun. I'm just like my man, my yeah, man. He... Sometimes the coverage is so good, no matter what you're doing. I'd be thinking because it's gonna be a pop a beat. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, uh, I'm gonna drain down the clock. Come on, come on. So that'll come back to the twenty. And Detroit getting set to go now. And that recipe on their last drive that resulted in a touchdown looked pretty good. So they'll be hoping to do that once more. It takes me back to when we sat with the offense coordinator and the head coach. They felt pretty good about their game plan and thought there were some holes in the defense and they exploited them the last uh -oh. time. Now, let's see if they can come back and put together a similar drive. And we'll see I if they can do man, just that. Yeah. Stupid First play of the drive, let's give credit all around. Excellent blocking. But the guy carrying the ball, he was the finisher. A really nice run. On second down, here's Stafford. Oh, he almost had it. Already with one interception, just missing his second there. The name of the game is always on defense, put pressure on the quarterback. And that's exactly what they've done today. It looks like they've got him a little bit rattled. That would have been the second interception in the first half. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, hurry up, hurry up. I see an extra defensive back on the field. A little surprise here on third and one. Stafford looking to throw on third and one. 
Oh, there's that man again. It's complete. And he gets it to the 34. Good enough for the first. And quickly, they get to the line. Come on, hurry up, hurry up. They go play action here on first down. And he can't quite bring it in. Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Steps there across the middle. Second down. And he's certainly not a guy that drops that football very often. Indeed, because that's a bit of a surprise. I know he's in the middle of some traffic and people, bodies all around him, but he usually has the focus to haul that one in. Here's Stafford. The left side completion to Jones. Eight yards on the completion, but now they face third down. Come on, come on, baby. Come on, let's go. A nickel formation here defensively. Play faked Abdullah. It's Stafford. That's caught inside the 20. Dang it. Uh, down deep into Bronco territory. You couldn't make it in time. You can add that zone. So we've reached halftime here in what is quickly turning oh, into quite a round. Man. As we send you on down to our studios in Orlando, where standing by is Larry Ridley with our EA Sports Halftime Report. Thanks, game. Brandon, and welcome to our EA Halftime Report. I'm Larry Ridley. The Broncos have been worked over in the first half and trailed big right now. The Lions have done a good job taking control of this game, and the scoreboard shows as much. So let's take a look at the highlights from the first half. After the INT, offense comes out now. Over the middle, Matthew Stafford completing the pass. And after the long pass, he'll score. Lions up by a touchdown. Now to late in the first. Abdullah's looking for room to run, and he'll win the sprint to the end zone. Lions up now by 21. We go to the second. Stafford's on target here, and he'll win the sprint to the end zone as they continue to dominate. About halfway through the second quarter, Stafford's going to complete the pass, and he's going to go 72 yards for the score. Lions with a commanding lead. Now midway through the second, wide open catch will be made on the deep pass. And after the long pass, he'll score. Lions with a commanding lead. Third down at the 33. Abdullah's got nothing but space here, and this two-play drive goes for a touchdown. The Lions in control. First and ten. Here the catch is made way downfield. And after the long pass, he'll score. The point's coming easy today. That'll do it for us here at EA Sports Studios. Let's get back out to Brandon and Charles for the call of the second half. Brandon. Alrighty, y'all. Um, we're going to end it right here. Listening to my ear. Crying tears. Alright, no, we're just going to end it right here. Alright, y'all. Peace up, Eric. You see, I had You made a goal of best. You like, subscribe, and comment down below if you want to see more of Matten, which you will see more of Matten today. At, after this video, I'm going to post another video about Matten, but we won't be in the play. We won't be in the playoffs. We won't be in the. Um, and um, it'll be Patriots versus Lions. So it'll be Patriots versus Lions. I'm about to do Baltimore versus uh, um, us, but no, we ain't gonna do that. Cause I made Lamar Jackson and I did not post it. That's the problem. But yeah, look. So we're gonna end this video right here, and we're gonna after this video, we're gonna post another video, and you will have some fun with that video. All right, y'all. Peace out, Eric. You see you at the table. Go best like, subscribe, and comment down below. Want to see more? Which you will today. And um, yes. And may the good Lord bless you and have a nice, blessed Christmas. Love you.